In January 2016, a farewell event was held for the Series 205 that was running in the Tokyo metropolitan area. After being retired from service on the Nambu line, the series will be exported to Jakarta in Indonesia. Lots of rail fans gathered to send the trains off. The Series 205 is a commuter train that first entered service about 30 years ago. It ran on the Yamanote line in central Tokyo and other metropolitan lines. Before they can be exported to Indonesia, the Series 205 cars must be inspected. Engineers and other technical staff from PT Kai commuter Jabodetabek, the Jakarta Metropolitan Railway, are visiting Japan to meet the Japanese staff. They're here to review the current condition of six trains that are being exported. They pay particular attention to the condition of the air conditioning system. <laughs> Now they're checking the headlamps of the train. Inside, checking that the air conditioning is effectively cooling the cars is most important. Staff from the Japanese side turn the air conditioning as low as possible to demonstrate just how effective it can be. They check whether the doors open and close properly and if the announcements can be heard clearly. The engineers and technicians then carefully inspect the condition of the wheels and other parts under the train. Okay. Okay, okay. All of the data that's been recorded about each train in Japan is carefully checked. Finally, the trains are taken for a test drive to check acceleration and braking, noise levels and general passenger comfort. After the inspection is complete, everyone sits down to discuss any final details. Now the entire process is complete. Japanese manufactured trains are known for their high quality. Even though the trains are second-hand, they can be used for another 20 years. By 2018, Jakarta Metropolitan Railway passenger numbers will increase from 800,000 to 1.2 million. In the future, we want to import more second-hand Japanese trains.